day in the world. It wow. is. Happy yeah. belated birthday. Thank you. Okay, you're talking turkey this morning. I am talking turkey. So I was just saying earlier, yeah, this is, to me, I think this is one of the, the things that intimidates people in America the most. Yeah, oh, yeah. The only real, like, holiday that we own. <laughs> you know, so it's a little, and so you've got to, but, and I think you're always feeding a lot of people when you you're are, making a you turkey. Are. So the other you feel is the you mess pressure, it up, you're in trouble. Yeah, you're going to Wendy's or whatever, whatever, you know. Okay, so first things first, you want to stuff your turkey. Nobody actually puts stuffing in the turkey anymore. Right. And if you've never done a turkey before, there's stuff inside there you got to take out That's first. Right. Pull yeah. that out, yeah. pull the gizzard out, and pull the little plastic thing that you carry it with. Right. Generally, you want to take that you out. You don't want to cook that. Yeah. I've done that before. I've done that before. I've come close. Okay, so we're going to stuff it with some leeks. Leeks are just, you know, like these really sweet onions mm -hmm. that you buy at the store. And you want, you want to get some seasoning in the bird. So i got some fresh thyme here. You know, and you really literally just stuff it in there like this. And you're not doing anything to this. No, and then some, right some lemons. Shove those in a little citrus. always helps. Right are into the cavity. Are you squeezing that in there or no? You're no, just, you don't need to. It'll, it'll okay, leak well. out. And then a little bit of garlic. Now, the thing is, make sure your turkey is thawed. I know that sounds crazy to say these things, but yeah. um, when people start cooking things they've never cooked before, they don't think. It's like trying to go get a lift ticket at a ski resort. Right. Where, is this, where do I get it? And it says lift tickets. You know right. what I mean? Right. So just kind of use your common sense Follow a little bit. Follow the directions. Yeah. So what I'm going to have you do, Tim, is I got some melted butter here. Mm -hmm. I got lemon zest, which is just the peel of the lemon. Right. Okay. Add that in there. Okay. All of it. Yep. And then we've got some uh, paprika and mm -hmm. some cumin. Add that in there. Mm -hmm. That's some thyme. Now we're making it just a little crust, that's a little lemon juice, so okay. it does, it dries the skin a little bit. Right. So you want crispy skin, right? Yeah. Okay, and dump a little garlic in there. So we, that flavors our, our bird here, and this is what we're going to do. Now, I've folded the wings back, and then you're going to want to tie after you stuff it. Remember, not before, but after you stuff it. You want to tie the legs together. So I'm going to do this quickly for TV. So you twist them up and just draw it together like this. You want the legs to come tight like this. Okay. Now, if you're freaked out by this, we're going to, I'm sure, have this video posted yeah, on the website. <laughs> so you can go back and watch it and go, what did so he do? tie it, right? And yeah. then okay. we're going to take our mixture of butter and right. we're going to paint this bird everywhere. Okay, the whole thing. You gotta have, that means you got to lift the bird up, right. paint around the outside. Okay. Now, I noticed this particular one has one of those little a button. thermometers in yeah, there. Yeah, the, the turkey button. Now, you can be a hero and and test it yourself with your own thermometer, right? Yeah. We're going to cook this at 350 degrees. Now, depending on the weight of your bird, it's different. But the most important thing is stick it at 350 degrees in a roasting pan where it can drip. Okay. okay like I see. It's going to be all painted. We're going to season the heck out of it with salt and pepper. And I mean, don't be afraid of it because yeah, you I, want the skin to be crispy and right. really seasoned. And it's a very big bird, by the way. And yep. you think these thermometers work? The ones. That yeah, and when it pops out, out, that's when it's ready. Now, you don't have to be a professional to know when the button pops. Right. <laughs> Thank wanna, goodness. For you. They, <laughs> Thank goodness. They make it change. <laughs> they make it easy. So, uh, because trying to do your own thermometer, especially the first time you cook a turkey, right. yeah. is not real smart. Let them do their own technology for you. Right. That's why they do it, so they don't get sued and all that stuff. Right. So, but the, before you carve it, you want to let it rest, and it will continue cooking a little bit when you take it out of the right. oven, right? That's right. Take it out of the oven, yeah. let it sit, man, yeah. with a beautiful little bird with a crispy, Look nice brown thing. crust on the outside of it, yeah. just like this. Yeah, we should say congratulations to you because you opened an Austin Lonesome Dove location yes. that I hear is fantastic. And then you're going to be opening one in Knoxville as Knoxville, well? Knoxville, Tennessee, that's correct, in January. So in we're very January. excited about that. And your big show is going to be airing and again And season three January? airs in January as well, Restaurant on, Startup. On, on CNBC. CNBC, right, right. Yeah. And find uh, uh, a link uh, or the recipe, most important thing. That's we'll sure. also post this little video, a little uh, how to do <laughs> on there. And uh, more information on fox4news.com. Always great to see you. Happy Thanksgiving and belated yeah. happy birthday. Same to you guys. Thank, thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. We'll be right back.